guys do I have a package for you you guys know how much I love butterbeer this company does as well so they went ahead and sent me a 12 pack of their amazing really cool refreshing drink and I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it right here right in front of you guys so that way you guys go ahead and check it out and I'm gonna go ahead and do a little taste test for the grand opening of the shells I actually really wanted to go ahead and do this a long time ago this one this was going to be the very first video that I was going to post uh, here in the studio but with the 20th anniversary of the Sorcerer's Stone uh, that video had to be postponed until now so without further ado let's just start the video and check these drinks out you're a wizard Harry What's up guys, my name is Johnny, I go by The Collecting Wizard and today we are taking a look at this really cool treat that they went ahead and sent me uh, and by they I mean the Flying Cauldron. These are amazing drinks to go ahead and have if you are not close to the theme parks. They're very similar to the Butterbeer drinks in Universal Studios. I'm actually going to go ahead and open it and try it out and compare it to all the other Butterbeers that I've tried. If you guys do not know, I love Butterbeer and i have actually gone to the warner brothers studio tour tried their butterbeer out went to the harry potter new york store tried their butterbeer out and i live near universal studios so i've tried both hot butterbeer cold butterbeer frozen butterbeer in both universal and islands of adventure so i don't want to say i am a butterbeer connoisseur but i do know a thing or two about butterbeer and actually i feel like i should change for the occasion to my butterbeer sweater so without further ado let's go ahead and take a look i need some space because you know i haven't uh, i haven't operated in quite some time so three two one Whew. check this out i told you i can still do it so without further ado now that we have the whole wardrobe in check Let's finally go ahead and open it. I actually had it open because I had it in Miami. There was, this company has so much patience because I was supposed to unbox this for close to over a month now. And I haven't tried it just because I wanted to have, you know, uh, the official video here. And I wanted to, you know, have it as a grand entrance for moving over here to Orlando. So guys, this, this has been a long time coming. So thank you again Flying Cauldron for sending me this, um, I'm sorry that it took so long to do, but we are finally here, wardrobe and all, and oh my goodness, I can't believe that's it. So guys, check this out, this is a 12 pack of 16 ounce cups, but yeah, butterscotch cream soda. Um, and let me actually just open this to go ahead and show you so I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a close look at the bottle um, but it says flying cauldron butterscotch beer butterscotch cream soda non-alcoholic butterscotch cream soda 16 ounces um, cream soda a magical brew prize for his creamy vanilla and butterscotch flavor flying cauldron is for wizards and unrealized wizards alike hashtag muggles never actually tried these but let's be the first i feel like i should get a butterbeer bottle but oh okay oh oh it's falling out hmm very butterscotch tasting tastes really good I'm not even gonna lie tastes really good tastes really damn good I wouldn't rate it you know super high up as number one that I've tasted ever but it's very very similar um, to butterbeer from the wizarding world I know it doesn't you know say that it's butterbeer but it's butterscotch beer I don't even know what to say I mean it's uh, I want to try it out um, you know putting it into a cup with um, blended ice try it out as a frozen butter beer I have a lot of different experiments to just try to do with this from doing hot butter beer to doing a frozen butter beer with this and testing it out um, to compare it to the one at Universal Studios because I personally think Universal Studios has the best 
butter beer um, not only with frozen butter beer but also the warm one as well flying cauldron if you guys want to go ahead and uh, sponsor me um, i would love to get a couple more cases of this to start doing experiments of my own and just you know showing everyone how amazing these are they taste really really good mm. these are actually new uh, it says here check it out new flying cauldron 16 ounce cans this handcrafted butterscotch brew is made with no artificial ingredients or flavors and has a hint of magic in every batch enjoy so yeah it says share the magic and I'm definitely gonna be sharing the magic if you guys have not followed me on Instagram definitely go ahead and do so it is the collecting wizard just like my channel name I will be going ahead and showing you guys a lot of really cool pictures and videos of this flying cauldron butterscotch beer so if you guys want to go ahead and check that out definitely follow along so that's going to be it for the video i guess uh, i hope you guys liked it if you guys did definitely smash that like button down below if you guys want to go ahead and check these out i'll go ahead and put a link of it down below maybe in my amazon storefront i do not know if it's there yet but if you guys are new here uh definitely hit that subscribe button down below because i talk about everything harry potter and theme park related content like this one on a daily basis so without further ado, I love you guys, cheers, and I'll see you guys on the next video.